Holla at your boy Bok Joy. It's Tommy and it's two in the afternoon and it's pouring out. I just woke up. This is what happens when you uh, finally get to sleep in a nice bed for the first time in a couple weeks. And yeah, it's pouring. I gotta find something to do today because as I said in yesterday's vlog, Boulder's closed. It will not officially close today. Day. It was open the last two days, which is a bummer that I wasn't home for it, but it opens up for the season on Wednesday. So Wednesday, I will be heading to Boulder. And tomorrow, I'm heading to New York City, so Tuesday's vlog. It's gonna be lit. But for now, I'm gonna find something to do. Alright, so I hope you could see my head, but I did make breakfast. We got some eggs and meat, um, peach tea, uh, of course, and then this stuff right here, it's called Hank Sauce. It is like the best hot sauce ever. This one right here is uh, camouflage, because it's not too hot, it's just in between. I got one of the hotter ones in the fridge, but I'm running low, so I may need to restock up on that. Um, besides that, Let's eat. Uh, we also need cornstarch and protection sugar. Recommended tools, a rolling pin, a small tangled spatula or garden handle. Scissors are apparently in plastic layers. Yep, no. Grating brush and I'm not buying anything else. Oh, I got more stuff. I wonder what this is. Let's mm -hmm. figure out what we're doing today. What? That's how long to my viewers, Mom. It's fine, you don't have to be quiet. We're doing the gingerbread house. The icing sets quickly. But mine didn't come built. That one did. So, a little sour. We're gonna figure this out though. Let's just time lapse this. Alright everyone, so I'm in the process of, oh, let me pause this, watching Sing, 
Uh, I'm in the process of editing today's video. Sorry, I was trying to figure that all out because I'm going to New York tomorrow. I don't know what time I'm getting back. Upload speeds at my house are different than upload speeds back at school. Um, it's a lot slower here, so I kind of have to get it up tonight. Um, it's currently 11.30. Just posted uh, the motivational quotes for the day. A little late, but um, that's what happens when you're back home when you don't wake up till 2. So as you can see, built some gingerbread houses. But very quickly, what I want to discuss is inspirations in my life. So... Um, I'll do a more in-depth video, but I'm just going to talk about two very quickly, and the first one's going to be music, and the second one's going to be YouTube. So, the first one for music, first inspiration, the only music inspiration I'm going to be talking about today is Mac Miller. And the reason why Mac Miller was such an inspiration is, he came from PA, PA boy, and he just had such a positive vibe all the time. So, like, wherever life takes me, find me with a smile, all things like that. His music just had such vibes to me that it always was part of me like it was always something I wanted to listen to and when swimming came out um, it was a sadder jam but you know people go through those points in their lives and I wish he made it through it but you just gotta remember to um, smile because it happened don't be sad that it's over or whoever that quote goes because you know I sit there and I listen to his music every day and it's just such a positive vibe and if you constantly look at the good things that happened you'll have that smile on your face all the time instead of looking at the bad parts. Like, yes, he's gone, but his music lives forever. So there's always that. And secondly, my YouTube inspiration is Casey Willax. I found him not too long ago. Um, many other music and YouTube inspirations, just let me throw that in there quick, that I'll talk about at a later time. But right now, Casey Willax. So when I was starting off the positive chain that I started, or I'm part of, not started, I work with it with Kyle McCann, um, Casey, he said, look at Casey Willox, his You Love Snowboarding, and his positive vibes that for the dream, all that stuff, that just resonates with me. And anytime I message that guy about, you know, just, hey, look, got your stickers, all that, which is on my laptop now, too, um, he responds.